it's, it's not boring, it's, it's exciting. It's, it's like a performance. Everything you do, it's, it's, you, you, it just, it's just high. You know, it's just, it's, it's action. And you, 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 you never can, you never can command, be in command of it. You can just master it so far. And then, you, so, so you use a lot of the, of the things that happen in the painting to the advantage. And so it's just out of, out, of, out of my control a lot. And I like that. And there's no turning back. Once you, once you, once you get out there, you out there, you know, with it. You can't, you can't change it, you know. You can't decide, oh, I don't like this, you know. I'm gonna have to change that, and that doesn't happen. Because that, that, that goes back to my raising. That goes back to being a country boy, to coming up in the, in the rural area, you know. And, and that's, that's, that's what I saw every morning. That's, that was my whole life. And, I, you know, I've been in cities and lived in cities. And, you know, it's almost like, you know, I'm not at home unless I'm in, in the natural. A beautiful, just a wonderful place. It's a wonderful place for artists. I mean, I can't imagine you know anybody coming here if they can paint. They're not wanting to paint this, no matter what the medium, you know. But it's perfect for watercolors. Every every you know every two hours, it's different, you know, with the light. And then you know the fog fog comes in in the morning, and you know we got this beautiful fog lifting and. Then in the then up in the middle of the day it gets this beautiful sun and all this light. It's just and it, the way it plays on the water and the rocks. It's just it's just I can see why artists you know want to come here and work. It's a beautiful beautiful place and exciting and it's 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 it it lends itself to watercolor I think. Yeah, changes, changes, you know, I mean, I mean, in 15 minutes when I'm down there working, it, it's changing constantly. It doesn't bother you? Well, no, because I kind of, you know, like, like the other morning when I started that, that piece, it was real foggy. And then about, I don't know, uh, next morning when I got up, well, it started raining. And then the next morning when I came back out, well, you know, to, to work, well, it was bright sunshine. And it was totally different. But I was able to remember the way it looked. You know, and so I, I, I tried to make my painting the way I, saw, I had sat down the day before when it started raining, because that's the way I drew it. You know, I had my drawing in, you know, my sketch, and so I just wanted it to be in the fog, you know, a little foggy. But then by the time I was working on the rocks, it was bright, clear, so it might not, you know, I may have a little more light on, on the rock area. You know, I like to work. I like to work in sunlight, and even though you know it's bad for me, but it's, it's good for my work. I've lived in Dallas some, you know, Houston. Um, actually, I didn't live in Dallas, but you know, I, I, I uh, but mainly was Houston. I, I grew up in Northeast Texas, in uh, Cass County, uh, in the, uh, near the town of Linden. living in Keechai, Louisiana, which is even, you know, tiny, a tiny, even smaller than the town I grew up in. It's even smaller. So, but, but, you know, I'm real close to...
be honest with you, it's always, I'm always going back to a place I saw when I was on my way somewhere else. I never go looking for a painting to paint. I have done that here, but I'm gonna tell you, I, is that, you don't have any tr trouble doing that here because every place you look's a painting, but normally I don't see that every day like I do here, you know, and it, it's, it's kind of so, something you get out of the corner of your eye, you know, and you do a double take, you know, like the light hitting a field a certain way in a certain time of day, and I'll always, when I do that, I always look at the clock or look at my watch, you know, and say, what time is it? Maybe I can catch this here tomorrow, you know, at the same time, you know, because, and so I'm always going back to some place I've seen on my way somewhere. It's not. Over the years, you know, studying watercolors, uh, they, all, they all came to Maine. And, you know, I just kind of traditionally wanted to, to do a watercolor here, or more than one. You know, rocks kind of rock formations and, you know, going back to Winslow Homer and people like that. So that, I mean, that was one reason. But, you know, I mean, it's so beautiful here. Why not? I mean, it's, it, everywhere place you look is a watercolor. see something that is spectacularly beautiful you know uh, you know I, I, I wish for my paintings or I wish I had time to paint it but usually you know maybe I can just take a photograph or something uh, but but I usually don't have a camera with me anymore I used to take a camera with there where I went but I don't do that anymore but it's you know I my, my reaction is usually just to, you know I sometimes I see it in my sleep, you know, I have to try to get back to that place. Mm -hmm. 